guys, Max Media Girl here. In this video, I am making a gorgeous flower resin bowl. So this is an irregular bowl mold and it is one of my favorites. I'm using Mixed Media Girl Artist Resin for this project. And the flowers that I used for this project, I actually had put them in another project and I didn't like how they looked. So I took them out and I wanted to use them still instead of just throwing them away. So I decided to try this out and see how it went. I started off by spritzing my mold with 91% isopropyl alcohol. This is just to help with air bubbles in the resin. I then put down a tiny bit of clear resin and then I put the flowers in there face down because obviously um, you want them to be face up on the inside of the bowl. I actually let that cure, so let it cure for you know overnight or whatever. And then I am doing the color of the bowl as a dirty resin pour. And these are all custom colors. These are a combination of um, polycolor copper mica powder, polycolor gold mica powder, and a lumilite white resin dye and a lumilite red resin dye. So these are all just various colors that I mixed up using those four products. And this will be nice and warm colored because of the gold and the red resin dye and hopefully will come out just gorgeous. I put all my colors together in a cup using about five ounces. And then I, again, pre-spritzed it with some 91% isopropyl alcohol. And then I poured all the resin in at one time. Pour slowly when you do this, you wanna give the resin time to seep down. If you pour too fast, you might have to do it kind of a little bit more in stages of pouring. But in this case, I was able to just pretty much pour it all pretty slowly and took up the entire five ounces in my cup, which you kind of saw I had it filled to the brim. And then I, again, spritz it with 91% isopropyl alcohol. Now as a tip on these molds, definitely come back in about 15 minutes and spritz it again with the alcohol because air bubbles will continue to pop up. And if you just leave it, then you'll miss those air bubbles. And when you come back and your project is cured, they'll be cured in there and you'll be sad. So come back in 15 minutes, spritz it again, and you should be good. I then let it cure for a couple of days and demolded it. This is not the easiest mold to demold, but it's also not the hardest. And it gets just a beautiful product every time. So I think this worked out amazingly. I love, love, love how this came out. And just to explain, the reason why I did the little bit of resin first and the flowers and let it cure, then put the rest of the resin, is because if I tried to do it all at once, the flowers would move around and I didn't want that. So I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all next time.